Here's how to add rounded corners to an image in Canva. First of all, head over to Elements in the left sidebar and then make sure to select Frames. Then search for rounded corners. Now simply drag and drop the desired frame into your project. And you can then just drag your image onto the frame. And your image then has rounded corners. Now let's talk about how to add rounded corners to a shape in Canva. The easiest way to get a shape into your project is by pressing either R on your keyboard for a rectangle or C on your keyboard for a circle. Now, no matter whether you added a rectangle or a circle to your design, in the top toolbar after you added it, you will see shape. Click on that and you can then change your shape into whatever you want. In our case though, we do want a rectangular shape, so we will keep our rectangle. Now, to add rounded corners to a shape, here's how you do it. Click on the shape, then click on border style in the top toolbar, and then simply move the corner rounding fader to the right to add rounded corners. This works for most shapes that you can find here under shape, even for stars. Now, last but not least, it needs to be mentioned, as we have seen in this tutorial, there is no direct way to add rounded corners to an image in Canva. The best solution that we have is, as discussed before, to put your image into a frame that already has rounded corners. While this works fine, it comes with certain limitations. For example, if you would like to add some effects around your image with rounded corners in Canva, then this might not work properly. For instance, if you would like to add a drop shadow to your frame, then this might not work as expected. With that said, there is one great workaround to truly add rounded corners to your image. And it only takes you about 10 seconds. And this workaround is to use the website pinetools.com slash round-corners-image. Here's how you do it. First of all, click on share in the upper right corner, then click on download and download your image as a PNG. After your image has downloaded, head over to the Pine Tools website and under input image, upload the file that we just downloaded. And then here under options, you can simply round the corners of your image. Let's go with a radius of 20 pixels, for example. Then just click here on round to see the result. Perfect. If you would like to round it even more, simply increase the radius here and then click on round again. However, in our case here, I think that looks just fine. So if you're happy with the result, download your file either as a PNG, a JPEG or in a WebP format. I will go with PNG. Once it has downloaded, I go back to Canva. Then you can go to uploads and click here on upload file to upload our new image with rounded corners. In my case, as I have Google Chrome, I also have the recent downloads in the download bar here. So I'm simply going to drag and drop it onto the project from there. And as you can see, we have perfect rounded corners. And with this method, if you would like to apply some effects now, just as adding a shadow around your image, then this will work just fine. Let me quickly demonstrate. Click on your image, go into edit image, and then click on shadows. If it's not under recently used, simply scroll down until you see the shadows app and then click on drop here for a drop shadow. And we end up with a perfect drop shadow around our image with rounded corners. For more Canva hacks like this one here, make sure to watch the next video on this channel where I will present to you the 30 greatest Canva hacks ever. And some of these hacks will definitely come as a surprise to you.